Hey guys, oh my god, plays into the breach continues right now. Uh, we came, we're coming off of a loss. Um, yeah, I was overconfident in that. I tried to rush through the uh, the Blitzkrieg challenge. Um, but we're going to come back and we're going to try something new here. I want to use Abe again, and he has the, the armored skill and plus one re mech reactor, so he's like pretty solid right now. For the judo guys, we're missing... Uh, have mech armor absorb five damage in a single battle. So I was thinking, since the judo mech starts with armored, we could give the gravity mech, or Abe to the gravity mech, which would give him armored. And then basically, if as long as they take some damage, like we can probably hit that. And then we need a two or three island win for them, so we'll see how things go. There's also some other achievements in here. Let's see. Finish three islands uh, without powering a weapon modification. I don't know if we want to do that for this run. Finish three corporate islands and destroy every time pod discovered. That, you know, we could try that one. Finish three corporate islands without equipping any new pilots or weapons. That's... That might work too. I don't know. Uh, so we wouldn't want to go for like all of these at the same time, obviously, but we should keep those in consideration here. Alright, so we're going to get started with Abe running the gravity mech. We're going to try to do a, probably a three island victory here, but we'll see how things go. So let's get started. We need our science boy and our big boy here to uh, take some damage along the way. Abe's got a power up over here. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and give him the hormones upgrade so they hurt each other more. And let's get started with... Uh, hmm... Let's just go back to basics here. Defend the train. Do not kill the... Let's do the defend the train mission, guys. Let's go here. Alright, so we're going to put you over here. You back here. And... So you can pull people, so we probably want you, like, over here as well. I think he has the gravity gun. I think that's how it... I may not be remembering that 100% correctly, but I believe that to be the case. Okay, so attack order, so if we pull this guy, you can kill him, right? Okay, he's gonna do damage to him, and that's fine. And then we can just go ahead and probably chunk this guy into the water. And as far as things go, we're now golden here. I'm gonna go move up here and block a spawn. In. So this, if I'm correct, he should die, and then the train should be free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. I, uh, messing that off off the bat would have been great or terrible. Either way, you know how it is. Okay, let's undo this. Let's go ahead and toss you over. And you're on fire. Yeah, this is right, you're, you're hurt, but you're good right now. Everything's cool here. We can heal you up, as a matter of fact. And your turn right there. So, did we make progress on that? We got one damage absorbed. We're not going to get the five damage absorbed here unless they go kind of crazy on us. So that could be one damage absorbed. It could be two damage absorbed. <clears throat> we could... Hold on. If this is three damage absorbed total, then we'd need to get two more, which we could do if we walked our boy here. Like right here, and then shot... This is what I'm thinking. So that puts two damage on these guys. I'd have to walk our big boy right back in. We're gonna take a grid damage. Okay. 
heal you up. We need to get you right back into the mix here. So this should be... Yeah, we blocked three damage, so now we can get that achievement right here. So let's just go ahead and do that. We'll take the grid damage. It's not the end of the world. We get that achievement right out, right out of the gate. Yeah! Unbreakable. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. So good start. Good start. Now we just play normally. We don't need to concern ourselves with that anymore. Defend the satellite launches. We can handle this. Alright, we want big boy over here. We want, uh, probably... Probably we'll want you back sort of here. And we'll just put you here. Like, yeah, we, these, this is where the brunt of the problem is going to be, so... Time pod. I think we go for it, because there's still a pilot we're missing. Time pods have a chance at a pilot, so... We have to keep that in consideration, obviously. So, mm, we could hurt the time pod and kill this guy. Judo flip this guy so he doesn't cause a problem. And let's see. Let's just pull him away. So yeah, let's we'll do one damage to our, our thing here. This is not great, but we'll get rid of him. In the process. Nothing else gets damaged here. I think we can pull you in here and kill you, like with the gravity mech. Yeah, we can. So you're no longer threatening that building. And then we've got a little situation right here, obviously. Bump you out of the way, you're gonna die to this uh, launch sequence. damage in and everybody's in a good position the launch is going successfully looking looking good my dudes steel judoka doing it i'm glad we got that achievement out of the way right up right off the bat that's pretty good so we have gotten the, the time thing so we can if we don't equip another weapon or whatever we can still achieve like one of the achievements that are along the way it's a possibility Oh, you're not the right guy here. You can't make it. We could do this. Oh no! Okay, let's reset the thermal. Reset. That was a mistake. So. It was a mishap. So if we flip him, we can then pull you guys. Ooh, what happens here? Undo move. I think we need to pull you into him so that this uh, order is well defined. You're only doing zero damage, so that's good. Yeah, I didn't want. I didn't want to get uh, an explosion on the thing after I've already reset my turn. I'd prefer to. You know, keep it under control here. So let's push him over here. Launch happens at the end, right? NPC actions is number four. Yeah, so... We've already used your action. It seems like it should be... Oh yeah, we can just do this. And then, uh... 
pull you into your buddy here. There you go. That was a little harder for my mind to parse than it probably should have been, but whatever. It is what it is. We still made it out successfully, defending both launches, getting the time pop. Mission complete! We defended the satellite launches. We're geniuses. Come on, like new pilot! Reactor core. Okay. So, we gave the damage upgrade there. Let's see. I think we're gonna give the points to you because we want to make buildings immune to you, to your shot. It's uh, pretty pretty handy. Uh, let's go to the artifact vaults. Not a bad location for us, I think. I think it's probably decent. You're easy to deal with. Same for you. And same on you. Actually, you're probably the hardest to deal with because we can only get you with uh, with this guy. So that's protected. Let's flip you onto this so you block spawn and. And we can, uh... Hey, we could set you on fire here. There we go. You're gonna die to the fire. We block a spawn. He blocks a spawn. This guy dies. Not a bad turn. Pretty good little turn. Good little turn here. So one of the achievements was what? Don't equip any new weapons or pilots? That one seems like something we can try. I do. I would like to get a new weapon for the judo mech, but if uh, if nothing great presents itself, then I don't see why we should uh, not go for that. You know, seems like a decent idea to me. We repaired our friend. I love the armor on you guys, by the way. I think it's a pretty good setup, especially these guys, which are all about like getting in the thick of things, controlling positioning and stuff like that. I'm Pretty, pretty happy with that. Okay, I want to pop him into the fire. Doing one point of damage. You have enough health to do this. And as far as things go. Suplex you. Kind of want to suplex you over here. I just don't want him getting into the back areas. For the reason I want to try to keep everybody contained over here. So we're gonna take a damage from the block here, but otherwise he's good to go. We've taken two damage. We need to not take any more. He's gonna die of fire. So pop him out. Cover some health for you, boys. That's fine. You're doing one damage. And no, you're gonna die, so even better. Get tossed, my friend. And yeah. Victory for this one with no no problems. Love the armor. I, w I wonder if it, can you stack more armor? I don't think you can, but it'd be interesting if you can. Where they'd have to go through two points of armor to do any damage to you. I'm gonna guess that that's not how any of this works. Uh, so let's go with the take less than three grid damage. I don't like having to deal with the the volatile vec. Honestly. Alright, so these guys are going to come kill themselves, most likely. And if they don't, they're going to get flipped onto a mine and be killed. <laughs> okay, so we're going to move you up here to push this guy into the water. You're going to get... You're going to pull him. And you're going to... 
gonna flip this guy. I like Steel Judica a lot. I heard I heard bad things about them online. I mean we I think we went through this when I played them first off, because uh, like I had a I had an expectation that they were not gonna be very fun to play, but I enjoy them. They're not the easiest, you know, to kill a bunch of guys or whatever, but they're it's satisfying is is I guess what I would say about it. Getting rid of guys with them is satisfying. Lost a mine there, but that's fine. Now let's go block some spawns here. And end our turn. We got a flying boy. And another little uh, artillery friend. Artillery friend is easily going to get popped into the water. Your buddy was there in the past and the same thing happened to him. Goodbye, my friend. And then for you... Your fate is to be pulled onto one of these and block it. And you're just gonna heal up over here. You're gonna block a spawn. That is your your place in life. Wrap me up. Yeah, it's fine, I don't care. I can kill both of you with one artillery shot right here. We're gonna pull you here and then flip you into the water. How do you like that? That's a fun little ride you took, isn't it? <laughs> you wanna go on that ride again? Too bad you're dead. Too bad. Okay, our middle guy was promoted. What did he get? A reactor slot. That's good. Siege. Siege mech needed that reactor slot. Let's take the building's immune thing over the movement here. We're gonna report directly to corporate HQ. Okay, we got the Blobbo. Blobbo's a... I, I think I have the hardest time with Blobbo out of all of the, uh, the friends we could encounter here. All right, let's put you here. I don't know what you, your guys' plan is, but apparently it's to just uh, not do anything. It's a fine plan. Comes down to it. Okay, we're gonna do this. And I am gonna toss you for a point of damage. If we need to get any injuries on you, we can. Can you not run through the water? Like, you really seemed like you didn't want to go through the water, but you're a big boy and it doesn't really matter to you. As, uh, as far as I know. So I'm gonna pull you to split this. Mm. I do want to split this so I can throw him potentially, but I'd rather these guys not hurt our buildings. And he's not going to be able to flip anybody if he... Oh, this guy has to be dealt with, too. So I kind of do need to do this. Let's go ahead and uh, pull him into this. Now we can do a little... A little flip action. We could even... Here, I think we it might be worth taking a grid damage here to do this. We're going to take two grid damage, actually. I think it's fine. Pleased with it. I mean, we're gonna take a damage here and we're gonna take a damage here potentially, but it's all for it's all for the good of the I don't know. I don't know. It's greater good. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> maybe it's for the greater good. Yeah, surround me so that I can hit you with artillery again. That's fine. I'm cool with this. So, one artillery shot kills three of these, no, four of these guys. 
We need you to be moved, obviously. So I could either pull him away or I could just throw this guy. <clears throat> I think I'll just throw him probably, but I need you to not damage our corporate tower. That part's pretty important for the overall, you know, completing this thing perfectly. Perfect victories are gonna get us a chance at pilots. We're still missing a pilot, so I'm interested in trying to achieve those. I don't necessarily want to equip a pilot if we get it, because I'm trying I might try to go for that one achievement. I don't think we're gonna go for the spend spend no currency achievement, but you know. Things could change here. So he's attacking this. We need our boy here to not get hit by a blob. Easiest way to not get hit by a blob is to do this. And then we can flip you over. And unfortunately, I can't... You're not flying, so I can't really stop this from happening. Let me take a look at this turn once again. I'm pretty sure this is basically how it has to go down then. So. I just wanted to confirm it. Because the only other thing I can do is send him to deal with this one. And then have him like... I could have him smash the blob in. But the net result is basically the same in this case. So yeah, let's just get rid of him. And I don't think we can... We can't gravity pull you or anything. So we're just going to end this turn. You're going to hit this thing. That's fine. As long as you're not hitting the corporate tower, we're gonna get the bonus objective, we're gonna complete it with a perfect island. I don't know, things are looking... All right, all right. Could've gone worse. Archimedes, move again after shooting. Wait, is this the guy that I don't have? Hey, it is. Okay, so he was the one on that list that it looked like I didn't have. Maybe there's more, I don't know. But I thought there was like one slot missing, so... Move again after shooting is huge. So we're not gonna go for that achievement. We're just gonna use Archimedes, I think. I wanna use him on, uh... I mean, I guess I should put him just over here. So we can get a move after we shoot we can flip somebody and then run somewhere else to like block an attack seems like a decent strategy self-destruct not gonna use it this time rocket fist I like since we equipped a new pilot we may as well like potentially take a weapon as well so I like the idea of having rock I think we did this actually before or did we give him the lance no, I think we gave him a rocket fist. I think this basically went down the same as it did before. So I am going to pick up a rocket fist. I'm going to pick up two cores, and I'm going to pick up a grid power. Now, maybe we should have picked up more grid power, but... I'm okay with this. We're going to power the rocket fist. And we're gonna power fire and forget here. So we're gonna have, he's gonna have some options here. Judo mech has got some options. So let's go to the next island. So we're looking for a two or three island win here. That's what we're looking for. Defend the earth movie, mover, protect the robotics lab. Plus we get to the difficult ones here. I think we start with the Sierra Quadrant. That's just how I feel. We got a leaper. We got the boy charging. Uh, so we can pop him off the edge. 
gonna do zero damage to me if uh, we allow it, but we can instead get you to do damage to your friend and kill him. I'm fine with that. And let's pop you off over here. Oh wait, never mind. Undo that. each other but we can't deal with this guy fortunately he's gonna hit a building not a great start not the best of starts oh wait can we get him over here no we can't I was gonna say if we could move him over here then we could just take impact damage instead which would be cool Yeah. Eh, it's not the end of the world. Send our turn and take this damage. I don't like it, but what are we gonna do about it? You can't. Just don't cry over. Just move on. We're gonna try not to lose off of that, obviously, but. We're gonna do what needs to be done here. So how much impact damage can we get here? We can break you. here in case we need to go deal with this boy which we probably will that was a dangerous turn we took a lot of damage there okay we can punch him off the edge I think Let's go ahead and pull him over and we can either punch him off the edge or we can launch off the edge although we could just let's just block the movement with you and then yeah, pump you into the water. And then return you up here to the front lines. So he's gonna take a damage. You're gonna take a damage and you're gonna take a damage. But everybody is gonna survive. And we've only got one guy to deal with here, so. Not not bad. Not bad. Could have been worse. So just give him a little shove here, he's toast. You guys can heal up and we can end this. You didn't need to heal, but it would have given me a prompt saying that other things were going on. It was actually a little faster probably just to tell you guys what to do. Understood. Oh, you got grid defense as your thing. Eh, eh, not the greatest. Hey, I want to give you some more movement, I think. Just to be able to get you into better pulling positions. Defend the uh, solar farms and block Vex spawn. We got you. We got you. Okay, this solar farm is like pretty easily defended. Pop these guys off, maybe. Oh yeah, that'll hurt our building. We don't want that.
This will kill both of them. And then we need you and you to be dealt with in some manner. I think we just flip this guy. We could... No, pushing him is going to get us hurt, so let's flip him. And then we can pull you. Over here, which should cause you to hit him. And then we want to go block his ball. Enter. threatening or anything so let's go ahead and how do we want to deal with this <clears throat> how much does this do just one point a piece we can do this And you only do one damage, so we can we can always stand our big boy in front of you. So punch him. And then, let's see, let's pull you back one. And then let's go stand you in front of this. And... I'll do the damage there. He needs to take some... Uh... Oh, well now he's not even gonna hit us, so whatever. It's, it wasn't gonna do any damage to my guy anyway, but. We're gonna need to go ahead and block two spawns next time, so we gotta be on the ball with that. We might actually be screwed here, because I don't know if they're gonna give us enough spawn points here. They didn't. So we cannot achieve that goal. So he's gonna hit him. gonna shoot back and kill him put you in the middle maybe hold on let me move we need you to get dealt with how are we gonna get that guy We could flip... No, we don't want to flip him over here. Hmm. This is inconvenient. Okay, let me reset this turn real quick and try to start this from the... From scratch. one one bit okay so we can pull you out of the way if both of these guys do this and then we can throw you out of the way or push you Let's push you and put you back over here, and then turn. It's gonna be a mess of guys over here. At least some of them are killing each other. They wanna attack us, that's fine. This will 
get at least one of you out of the one that's hitting the objective. We're gonna fail one of the objectives, so keep that in mind. <laughs> There's no uh, nothing we can do about that at this point. I wish I could get him in the way there. Oh, I guess I could pull him over here, and then he can stop this, because he only does one damage. This guy's hitting nothing, this guy's hitting nothing, this guy's hitting nothing. So yeah, we can pull you. And now... Now this will work out. We didn't get a perfect island, unfortunately. We lost this block spawning objective because there were too many guys on the field. But we got some grid back. So that's a, that's a thing. Destroy two mountains, kill at least seven enemies, protect the power generator. I'd like to accomplish this, but I'm kind of worried based on our... Oh, defend the power. Yeah, let's do this one. Start with this one. We know we can handle these ones. We we have proven again and again that we can do the terraformer ones without incident. Let's see if we can keep that thing rolling. I don't think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we've always accomplished terraformer one without any major incidents. So you got to respect that. Obviously, we're gonna blow up this side first. boy and the other big boy now I need to grab this and then I guess we can just pop him over and that's fine we'll block this spawn go ahead and block this spawn right here just keep it, uh, keep it a little cleaner in the environment here. Oh wait, that's not the right button. End, time. End your turn, please. Ah. <laughs> Slam my feet into the desk. That's not great. Not the smartest of moves, for sure. Okay, so we can kill you, automatically. And... For you. And just heal yourself up, buddy. You're good. End your turn. Okay, two more sides to take out. Or is it two more? Or just one more? We gotta take this side out for sure. And uh, yeah, there's one tile over here as well. Or two tiles. Two tiles. I can count. So let's blow you up. Actually, can we get him in here? We cannot. What we can do is pull you over here, and then we can blow this side up. Get terraformed, son. Son. I don't know if you know this, but you have been officially terraformed. Alright, let's leave you there, and for our buddy here, what, what can he do? Uh, he can't do anything, because we... I mean, he could shoot a missile. There's no point. There's nothing for him to shoot at. Okay, so we need to get the thing on this side. So what I'm looking at is... A little bit of this action. A little bit of boom. Completed both terraformer objectives. We can toss this guy or just straight up punch him. And then be free. Be free, my friends. You're all good. Nice, nice job, gentlemen. You're a champion, Abe. 
What's in our time pod for today? Reactor core. Oh, we got mech move for Abe. That's nice. Does that mean he has six movement? <laughs> That's kind of crazy. Perhaps we should move it into health or something like that, but whatever. I'm going to keep the high movement. I really like having high movement. It's pretty good. Let's see. I think we probably need to up his uh, movement. He's got the lowest. I, I really want to move his as well, or change his as well, but we'll get it soon. Destroy two mountains, kill at least seven enemies, protect that. I don't know. That one sounds a little rough for our team. Whereas kill seven enemies and protect the thing with a lightning storm happening, I think this is going to be a little easier for us to stop. Uh, let's move you back here. You got super high movement, so I didn't just didn't want you getting caught up by this little this little guy right here, Mr. Web friend, WebMD. Okay, so we can pop you guys around, puts him into a murder zone. We can then, so he's got nothing going on. He's gonna die to the murder zone. And let's go get rid of him, so nobody has armor. I'll put you right here. I guess we could uh, just dispatch him as well. So two enemies down, three enemies down right about, uh, right about now. We need four more. Lightning is on our, our boy. Lightning is over here. Lightning is in the air. Lightning is everywhere. Okay. Let's start by... You in? You're gonna die. Let's get some damage in on this boy. Actually, let's just. Well, but he can block the spawn. I'm fine with you blocking the spawn, buddy. Ah, you know what? Let's just do this. Intense. Not gonna block the spawn with you, obviously. You only have one hit point. Okay, we need to try to get two more guys killed. Should be easy enough. So there's a one, there's one kill because he walked onto the thing. Let's look at uh, popping you over, a block a spawn, and then pushing you into here. Two guys are going to get killed by lightning, completing that objective. And let's end our turn here. Yes, please. Dead. And dead. You miss and you block the spawn. So we're gonna have two boys to deal with and one more lightning storm. And they're not even trying to hit any buildings right now, so let's do this. Put them over. And stay here. Yeah, let's just move people out of the way and then turn. Okay, let's make sure. Okay, so he's on this. Everybody else is clear of death. Yes. I didn't want to accidentally do one of those things where I lock in a bad result. <laughs> Happens way too frequently. The vet can clear out of the region. Corporate HQ. 
Let's see. I'm going to pop you here. Put you back here. And we'll leave you here. We'll see what happens here. Deceased, but that's going to be difficult. So that would be two damage. Undo. Undo. I'm just trying to check this thing out. So you're going to do three damage to me, which kills me. We need to pop you over so we're not taking any damage there we then need to I can't kill him without hurting a building easily what I'm gonna need to do is just uh, let's see I need to do something like this if I pull you into him <laughs> not the greatest of ways of doing it but whatever and let's put you back over, let's put you on this side, so. We gotta be able to do some damage to this boy, but. Start off and just not take anything and kill one guy is okay. Not the greatest, but okay. No! Stop it. You stop this right now. So I think we can do. Deceased. I can have him kill his friend and do a point of damage to him. Which is a start. And then. We just have to pull him out of the way and blast him out of the way. We're gonna try to destroy the Firefly Leader, but right now I'm just hoping to complete this without any grid defense loss here. Since we can't get a perfect island anyway, we just should play this as smart as possible. There's no point in completing the objective and losing a grid power on this, because that's like a one-to-one tra -one trade-off, basically. I mean, I guess the, the single point is more useful than just a grid thing. That is true. Can't argue with that. But, I mean, I guess you understand what I was trying to get at here. Let's pull him in to kill this. Oh god, this guy. Undo your move there for a second. Let's... Get something like this. Yeah, I'm gonna take grid damage here, unfortunately, but I think this is for the best. Hopefully it's not this, it, it was not. Whatever. I didn't really know how to deal with that turn, effectively, as you can tell. <laughs> okay, so this guy, what if we punch him? It's not good enough. We can flip him over here and he can run into the water. And then we can have you kill this guy. I guess do a little damage here, but it doesn't really matter. End your turn. Wait, where's our boy? Yeah, end our turn. We're good. We've completed two islands here. Uh, this is not a perfect island by any standard, but we got it. We got that going. 
We're gonna try for a three island win here. I think. More grid defense. I'm not not a huge fan. When you guys roll the grid defense. Oh, the swap is amazing. But we don't have uh, the ability to use it right now. I mean, we could move some of these things around, probably. So... Mm, I'm gonna get grid power and the power core. And we're gonna use... the power core on our guy here to get him some movement. We're not the best killers or anything here, but we've got some uh, we've got some stuff going for us. We're highly mobile. We're able to disrupt a lot of things. Uh, yeah. So I mean, I, I I like Steel Judica. I can understand why why some people don't though. But uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for this video, guys. Join me next time as we go for our three island win with them. Hopefully it goes well. We'll see. We've had some bad luck in the past, so I'm not. I'm not counting, you know, I'm not saying this is a guaranteed win or anything like that, but I feel pretty good about it. Anyway, uh, like the video if you're enjoying it, subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more, and I'll catch you guys next time. Later!